We've all heard of game engines and seen their logo pop up at the beginning of every modern game we play today. But what do they do? How do they work? What is a game engine? A game engine is a software framework that developers use to create a video game. They provide the tools and content pipelines for graphics, audio, and code scripts in video games, allowing developers to quickly create content without having to recreate the same infrastructure again and again. Back in the day before game engines, developers had to create everything from scratch. Plus, PCs and consoles had such little memory back then, they would have to be constantly deleting and reloading assets, making them slow and inefficient. These days, we have lots of different kinds of game engines, with all of them having their own unique features, but most sharing a common set of functionalities. Most of them will house the game's program that defines the game's logic and different states that the user will experience along with the game's graphics, audio, networking, physics, AI, and the list goes on. Some of the more well-known engines are Unity. Unity was developed by Unity Technologies and was released in June of 2005. It was responsible for such games as Angry Birds, Hearthstone, Pokemon Go, and Cuphead. CryEngine. The CryEngine was created by German developers Crytek in 2002 and has spawned such games as Far Cry, The Crisis Trilogy, State of Decay, Rise, Son of Rome, Kingdom Come Deliverance, and Prey. Frostbite. The Frostbite engine was developed in 2008 and has been used by Electronic Arts for most of their games. It has produced such games as Medal of Honor, the Battlefield series, Need for Speed, Plants vs Zombies, Dragon Age Inquisition, Star Wars Battlefront, Mass Effect Andromeda, and Anthem. And last but certainly not least, the Unreal Engine. The Unreal Engine was created by Epic Games in 1998 and has been the gold standard of game engines for over 20 years. It has produced an amazing amount of top-end games in the 20 plus years it's been about, such as Deus Ex, XCOM, Splinter Cell, Bioshock, Gears of War, Borderlands, the Batman Arkham series, Mortal Kombat, Devil May Cry, Street Fighter V, Fortnite, Days Gone, and the upcoming Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Plus, just like the Unity engine, Unreal is completely free to use. But game engines aren't just for making games. Epic's Unreal Engine is regularly used to make feature films and television shows and is starting to also be used more and more in the construction world too. During a game developer conference in San Francisco, Epic Games hosted a panel to talk about their engine and its use outside of gaming. The talk included NASA speaking about its use of the Unreal Engine to create a real-world holodeck. Walt Disney announced its plans to use the engine to create a Star Wars themed experience for its theme parks. And British car manufacturer McLaren showing off how vehicle design and even sales can be helped by the engine. So as you can see, game engines are not just a massive part of the game industry, but also have an increasingly bigger role in many other industries. So who knows how big game engines are going to get, but one thing is for sure, game engines are going to be a massive part of our engineering and technology future.